Section 1.6, solving linear inequalities. Um, first of all, linear is just a word that means, um, you know, it's like not squared or to the third power or something. It's just x. Um, and if we're going to solve an inequality, we should know what an inequality is. Um, okay, so I'm going to bring our minds back to something really important, and that's things being equal. And remember, that was the picture of a scales, a set of scales. So if things are all equal, then the stuff on this side, stuff, is equal. And in this case, we're, you know, the thing we're measuring is the weight. The weight of, of the stuff on this side is equal to the weight of the things on this side. Okay? So that's equal. That's great. They're perfectly balanced. Life is good. Um, there you go. But if they are unequal, not equal, right? That's that's what is meant by inequality. In equality, if there's two things, two sides here, and there's an inequality, that means a not equality. Well, if it's a not equality, that means that one side must be. If we're, you know, using the um, analogy of weight here, one side must be heavier than the other side. So if one side's heavier than the other side, let's say this side is heavier than that side. Okay, speeding up this drawing process. Uh, so it must be, oh, this side is heavier, excuse me. This side, the stuff is lighter than the things. The things outweighs the stuff. So it's not equal anymore. Um, and and rather than drawing this picture every time we want to work with numbers and stuff, which is ridiculous, we crea created a symbol. Um, the symbol being this. Okay, this just means that this stuff over here is more than th this. Or this th the things over here is m is more than the stuff over there. Um, why the symbol was you know, created to be this, I, I'm not sure, but it's, it makes sense, you know, this, to me, it, it makes sense, the, um, this side of the symbol is bigger than this side of the symbol, this side is really small, and this side is really big, and so the bigger side goes with the bigger things, and this, the smaller part goes with the smaller stuff, uh, okay, so, that's what this symbol means, it means, and we can actually read it from left to right, the stuff is less than the things, Right. The weight of the stuff is less than the weight of the things. Um, if instead, and I'm just going to um, get really kind of messy here, but uh, not take the time to erase everything. Uh, well, if the stuff is heavier than the things, then we have a different symbol. This symbol would be this way, because the stuff over here is, is bigger than the things over here. Okay, so stuff outweighs the things. and uh, So there you go. Those are those symbols. It's inequality. Now we have this other symbol for uh, if... Um, okay, this is going to get kind of silly, but kind of funny to me. You know, it's my humor. Uh, and I don't know if you'll think it's funny. But, you know, it's like there's the scales, and we know it exists. Um, but it's shrouded in this fog of mystery. Uh, there's, there's like this, this cloud in front of us. So we know there's a scale somewhere in there, but we don't know what's going on, except for we do know that the, that the, the stuff over here, um, it's, it's definitely greater than, uh, than the things over here. Uh, you know, and we're not sure by how much, and actually it could be as much as, uh, equal to, so we kind of put together the symbols of equal and, uh, and, and inequality. We're saying that the stuff is, is heavier, um, and, and at the most they're going to be equal to each other, but definitely the things are not going to be heavier, okay? So there's like, we're not sure what's going on back there, we can't really see it, we don't see exactly how much heavier the stuff is, but the stuff could be heavier than, or, or, or at the most it could be equal to the things. Um, 
Okay, so this symbol means that this stuff over here is bigger than and, and possibly equal to the things over here, and this symbol means just the opposite, that the stuff over here is less than, and at the, at the most, it's, uh, it's equal to this stuff over here. Okay, so that is, is that. And uh, you may not appreciate it much, but uh, I think it's important just to to define what an inequality is, know what the symbols mean, um, and we will get right into sample problems here in the next video.